What's up everybody, welcome back to my laboratory where safety is number one priority and today I'm gonna show you 10 amazing life hacks. Let's check this out, you guys are gonna be very surprised, I can't wait, let's do it. For this life hack you got this kind of chips, you know, bag of chips and you wanna open and share with everybody but you don't have a plate. What you wanna do is just grab it like that, pinch it and bite it a little bit. And now I can just like grab it and start spinning it like that. Like a small plate. Pretty much keep opening it. And here you go, you got plate full of chips or Doritos, whatever you want. You just set it on the table and anybody can enjoy it and share it. And you don't have to stick your full hand in the bag. You see how nice it is? Perfect. But this life hack, you know this CD box? You can actually use it like a lunch box. This is super cool. Like if you grab a couple of bagels, put some cheese cream on it or whatever you wanna put, make sure you still have the hole in there and you can put perfectly two bagels inside of your CD. And this is makes it perfect lunch box. Check this out. You can toss it anywhere. It's not gonna come out. It's not gonna smash them. It's like perfect, you know? You can not worry about your lunch getting smashed. For this life hack, I'm gonna show you how to fold the t-shirt like a ninja. Just grab it like this, boom. And it's all ready and folded. Check this out. Here's the front, here's the back. Nice, huh? Nicely folded t-shirt, check this out. In the back too, it's all nicely and folded. So if you're doing laundry, you can fold a whole bunch of them right away and stack them up if you have like 20 t-shirts. Here is how I did it slowly. Grab right here on the shoulder, in the middle of a shoulder and grab right here in the middle of a whole t-shirt. So let's say the middle somewhere over here. And then line up this line to here, like where you grab it pretty much on the same level. And just grab it and then go backwards and right here too, same thing. Just grab it, fold it this way and this one is just simple and it's ready to go. For this life hack we got microwave popcorn. You know, we're gonna put it in a microwave and I'm gonna show you super cool trick that you should always use. First we're gonna microwave some popcorn, then we're gonna take out the popcorn from our microwave and I'll show you super cool life hack. So what you wanna do is grab a popcorn bag and find on this side, you see, how this little slot is open right here. It's so the steam would come out and the air does not explode, you know. Just grab this bag upside down and start shaking it. And guess what? You see what's come out? All this unpopped stuff is going to come out. You know, and you're not gonna break your teeth. But do it over the garbage can. This is, I'm just showing to you how much will it come out. Now, in every bag there is unpopped popcorn. Look guys how much unpopped popcorn over there. And you might be grabbing popcorn and buy into it and break your teeth. So make sure you do this next time. And it's super simple, doesn't take too long. They're just like 15 seconds, shake it and you out of these things for the most part. For this life hack, I'm gonna hug the box of Pringles. Put the Pringles down this way, you cannot reach them. Let's say you grab your paper, you stick it in over the top, all the way in. You see what I'm saying? All the way in and you're gonna end up with this thing. Now you can turn it over and push it out and guess what? You got the sprinkles in stock, you know? And you can eat it without no problem, without taking out too many. And then let's say you eat this much and you're done. You can just push it back in, leave the paper, take out, and your Pringles still good to go. And I don't have to like push it like that and spill it all over my car or all over my carpet. It's all 
neat and tightly and clean free and not messing up your hand, not messing up everywhere. For this life hack, I'm gonna show you how to make a CD envelope. Put the CD halfway point like that and just fold this one in right here and make a parallel line. You see this white right here, kind of line it up with the back paper over there and fold it. Same thing on this side, line up with this paper under the CD, lined up over here and fold it down. Then what we're gonna do is fold it this way and fold it over here, make a couple creases and then and then we're gonna need to fold it this way just like that. Then we're gonna unfold it and fold this two corners like this one and two. So and then we're gonna open it and put it in like that, push it in. And this way we got the CD envelope. Very simple if you wanna transport it somewhere, it works very very well. Another very cool life hack, just grab a knife and cut your microwave uh, bag like this. Boom. and just open it and you see how this bag is greasy very very greasy so next time you're reaching in full hand in the bag and getting all your hand is in oil and butter and salt really nasty but now you can just grab it from a plate and you don't have to use another plate dirty another plate and go wash them so you can make a bowl out of a popcorn bag boom for this life hack, you're gonna need a flashlight. You know, one like this, it's like $4 at Walmart, really cheap ones, you can get more expensive ones. And a gallon of water. I'm gonna make sure we're gonna take the label off. Ah, shoot. As good as possible. But you wanna have no label whatsoever, but that's fine. So what we're going to do is flip the headband inside out and put it on a water bottle, like this. And then turn this flashlight into the water. Now we're gonna grab one of this and put it in total darkness. And guess what? We got 360 room lit up like a huge light bulb. Isn't it super cool? Next time you need cut a bunch of onions, chew a gum. It's actually help not to cry, you know? You, you're not gonna like get your eyes hurt and you're not gonna cry at all. You see how much I chopped up? Smells pretty good and my eyes are fine. You see, it's all chopped up. I'm chewing the gum and it's not hurting to my eyes. So this life hack does what? It's a little bit burning my nose, but I'm not crying. This is so cool, wow. If you're going in and out from your room and your door get closed by automatically, don't get yourself locked out. Just use a couple of rubber bands, put it over here, twist it, and put it on a handle over here. You see, you need like at least three or four rubber bands to make sure it will get tight enough. This is two. So you see your lock is holding the rubber bands. It's not gonna lock itself in. So let's say you're moving out somewhere and you don't want your door always get shut on you. And you coming back to get more furniture, you have to get your keys unlocked and you know, so annoying. But this will be super cool. And it will never lock yourself in and out. You see what I'm saying? Just pull it out. And this is what I'm talking about. You leave the door open, it just locks down on you. You try this again. So if you use this rubber band system and put this up like that, they're not gonna lock out on you. And if you need to go in and out a lot, 
without using your keys all the time don't like it you can use it in your house all right guys that's pretty much it thumbs up this video if you liked it and as always thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe subscribe to my second channel slow mo lab i have phantom v 2010 is the best slow motion camera in the world links in the description well and i'll see you next time and guess what look it's already all separated and you have watermelon cubes You see what I'm saying? Perfect watermelon cubes.